Good is everyone, welcome to Adam and Studio channel. I'm Iga and I'm back with another video. So in this one, I'm just going to show you how you can create your own characters and the process of how you create those characters, you know. And there's nothing that's going to be difficult in this one. You just need to understand and follow the procedures of how the things works. And um, yeah, it is going to be like that, you know. Imagine if Mandela was teaching people how to do things. It'd be like, you take your pencil and then after taking it, So here we are, um, there's a lot of uh, great softwares that you can use, um, yeah, but if you are interested in this one, you can go up in here, this is where you get it, www.uzorg, and then yeah, hmm, look at this bird, this is how you can create your things to be, so this one is 0 0.91, and then these are the tutorials that you might find, there's basics, there's shapes, there's advanced tracing and pixel, you know, like that so what we're gonna do first we're gonna look at sketching whenever you start your drawings obviously you have to sketch and these are my sketches right here but I'm just gonna choose this one this as I've just mentioned so what you need to do um, you just do like this here's the pencil that I'm gonna use it's on number four but if you draw on number four like this, it's going to give you a lot of notes and we don't need notes like this because we still have to control this like this. So just imagine how we're going to finish like this. But Mandela can do it. Mandela. Mandela. Okay, that, that, that was. So this is what you do. You take your pencil like this. You don't have to be on number four. Most I use um, number 62, you know, to make it smooth like that. Number 62, as you can see now, it just make two notes at the end. So you take those um, drawings right here, you use your pencil, just like you are tracing now. That's how you, that's how actually I do inking. Like this, as you can see, the line is getting straight. So like this, control set for deleting. Because I'm not using an eraser. An eraser is gonna take me like 54 million years, and now it's 2020. Just imagine I'm gonna be um, gone at that time. Okay, so this is what you do. Actually, just tracing and tracing and tracing. As you can see, this is the process of how the things work. So I just gonna wait time lapsing for this one because it takes a lot of time then yeah So I've done um, putting some inkings into this character right here. So right now we have to go up in there, if you still remember. Done inking, so now it's time for coloring. Then we're gonna get into a shadowing. I'm gonna show you right now. So coloring is just coloring. There's nothing unique about that. It's just coloring, you know. But I'm gonna show you how you color this. And then these are some of the other options that you might use. If you want your line to be thick or big or small, then as you can see, you just have to raise the pixels or you can choose this one. Most of the time I use this. As you can see right now, it's getting a little bit dark and big. So now I can add some colors. And then, yeah, this is how you just add colors. So yeah, this is it right now. You can see everything I've colored. So whenever you add some shadows, I duplicate the face colors like this. Then it's gonna give me the outline to see where I can just add. So let's just zoom in up in there. And then 
my color like this I just make it to be black and make the opacity to be half like that maybe 130 or 125 and I just paint inside the blocks right there and remove the outlines and then also here I need to duplicate this to have it like that remove the face it has to look like this so now you have a bit of a shade if you see that it's dark you just have to make it a bit low in opacity so yeah just use these ones like there as you can see now let me make him to be a little bit more darker because now it's just to be more human and then I'll just bring this like this like this and also this ear has to be the same as this one like this So I'll just add this to make the eyes to be a little bit shiny, like this, and also here, and then for these ones also, I'll just use this. Um, so this one it has to be a little bit skewed like this, because these are the glasses. So I'll just make it like this also. So yeah, this is how it looks when it's done. So thank you for watching and I hope I'll see you in another video. And if you like this video, you can hit subscribe. Don't forget to go into this um, website for this software if you want to use it. And I'll see you in another video. Much love, peace.